I remember growing up in the Scouts and I used to be engrossed with uh, torches. And it's been a while since I've played, with, played around with torches actually. So this Australian company called Hunt Pro offered me uh, a couple of their torches and I said, sure. I said, they, they look pretty good on paper and on video. And I said, you know, give it to me for free and I'll exchange it for an unbiased review. As I normally do with other companies as well. So they sent me a couple of their torches. One is a big one, one is a small one. That's the Mark 1, the small one. And the Mark 2 is the big one. I've had this for a while now actually. And I've been testing it on the road. And I'll give you my impressions. I'll do this a little bit differently. Uh, I'll start with what I think can be improved in the product just to make it a bit different than my other videos and then I'll talk about the good stuff about these torches. So let's start with the case. They put it in this case which is pretty nice you know you got you got your case with your torches that's good something to store it into. Um, I find the case to be not heavy duty though um, it's just a bit soft plastic the latches are a bit finicky like they're a bit funny sometimes especially these ones on the side see like that one doesn't clip but hey you know it's just storage and to be honest once you receive your product um it's probably going to live outside of the case anyway most of the time um so in the case a bit of padding and a bit of um leaflet with some info charging cable both torches charges via usb and th these sleeves, which I believe you can put a normal battery because um, it's a rechargeable battery, which you can remove from these torches. So that's that. Um, let's go to the torches. They look, they look really nice. Um, good feel, solid, pretty solid feel for both of them. Good design. The only thing I can find with this one, a couple of things. One is this flap here to charge the USB via USB. It's just a bit flimsy and the thing is it doesn't like I find myself always flipping it open. It's so easy to flip it open. All right that's the only it's a bit annoying and I can see that breaking off quite easily which means that the port's going to be quite exposed to dirt and water. Um, so if anything maybe improve that. Same with this other one. The other thing is I reckon a good idea is to have one side flat, flat. So you can put it and it won't roll like this. You know, like you can put it somewhere and it won't roll. Same with this one. So I reckon make one side flat and even better, make it magnetic. Magnetic strip, magnetic strip. So you can like put it there, face it here, on the wall, wherever, okay? I think that's a good suggestion for that one. So basic operation for the torches. Um, oh, well, let's take it apart, eh? So from the back, obviously, just like any torch, open it up and the batteries come out. It's rechargeable batteries. Okay. And from the front, you can undo that as well. But I think, uh, yeah, here, you can undo it here. It's a screw up. I won't do it now. Okay. So pull it forward um, and that gives you the zoom function focus in and backwards is the spread same with the small one okay see it comes off quite easily so that's it basic operation one press for the this is the big torch one press is your low beam um, second press is the high beam and the third press is the strobe and then off for this one I think there's four I think it's the low beam, oh no, sorry, it's the high beam and then the low beam, and then the lower beam, so three settings for the brightness, and then the strobe, and then off. Oh no, this is slow strobe, and then on off. So five, five settings in here. Um, you get the battery level here, there's four lights in here, four lights in here will get you the level of your battery, if it's charged up or not. So how bright are these torches? That's the main thing, if you buy a torch, you'd be after the brightness of it. They are very impressive. Now this would be a good place to test it. I'm in uh, rural New South Wales. Closest town is probably at least, I don't know, 50 kilometers from here. So it's super dark. There's no light for miles. In the middle of the night, can't see anything. Let's check this out. So low beam on the truck, 
high beam on the truck and torch high beam on the torch Ooh, crikey nice look at that let's change it to the spread Ooh, I'm impressed try here that's the spread Make it focus, come on, focus. There you go. And let's zoom it in. Wow. Those trees are at least about a couple hundred meters, I reckon. Huh. Just imagine seeing something scary, eh? That'll be funny. Focus, come on. There you go. Ah, oh, look at that. It's like a laser beam in the sky. Batman! I'm not making any money out of these torches, apart from the initial torches given for free. But I asked them because I'm happy with the product, I'm happy to endorse the product. Um, go, if you want to buy it, use the code RUGGED10, I'll put it in the description below, you can get 10% off. Again, I don't make any money out of that, but I reckon these are good torches. Really bright, very impressed with it, and I think they are worth the money for what, what they cost. So if you want, if you want one of these, go to the website and buy yourselves one of these. Thanks for watching guys. If you haven't yet, subscribe down here. Uh, more videos around here. And give this video a thumbs up if you like it. And I'll see you in the next video.